We here at LEX 18 are hard at work making sure to bring you the most accurate, best local election coverage. LEX 18's Kristen Edwards dives into that process and how it's changed with COVID-19. It's the calm before the storm, the day before election day at LEX 18. Inside, manager Mike Taylor, who's coordinated 68 elections for our TV station, prepares for tomorrow. We're picking up our two congressional candidates. Since 1985, Taylor has been at the helm of the newsroom on election day. I could have retired a couple months ago, but I wanted to stick around for this one because I think it'll be pretty historic. Part of the job, leading a group of volunteers stationed at each Fayette County precinct. When the polls close, they call back to another group of volunteers in the newsroom and share the results of each race at each polling location. Those numbers go straight to air, giving LEX 18 the reputation of getting early, unofficial results in first. And they literally take the data from that polling location, put it into this uh, computer program, which uh, it actually feeds our graphics, which goes right on the air. So it's pretty instantaneous. But this year, because of COVID-19, those volunteers cannot um, participate in the process. Yeah. Instead, LEX 18 staff will call in the results from Fayette County's eight polling locations. Then the Fayette County results will be combined with results from other counties, which come from the Associated Press. And when Taylor and a few other managers feel confident about which way a race is going, LEX 18 will make the call. Honestly, in Kentucky, if we're not done by, you know, mo for the most part, nine o'clock, it's something went wrong. So if everything goes smoothly by eight tomorrow night, Taylor predicts we'll have a good idea of who will win the Bar Hicks race. Between eight and nine, we could learn who Kentucky wants for president. And between nine and ten, we may know whether McConnell or McGrath will win the Senate race. From the newsroom, Kristen Edwards, LEX 18 News.